In natural systems, seeds germinate under specific conditions. We call this stratification, the process in which seed dormancy is interrupted and germination begins. In nature, this occurs with the changing of seasons. However, we can perform artificial stratification by mimicking these natural seasonal changes to encourage germination at our discretion. What I have here are the seeds from the New Zealand flax Harakike, also known as Formium tenax. We're heading into autumn here, so the seeds are just starting to fall from their pods and are ready for collecting. If left to run its course, they'll fall to the ground and a mulch layer will build up on top of them, which will keep the seeds pretty moist during the cold winter months. The combination of this moisture and the cold winter months trigger the germination. There are a few different methods to do cold stratification. However, today I'm going to show you how to put the seeds through the process in your home refrigerator. I begin by giving the seeds a good soaking in warm water for 24 hours. Whilst the seeds are soaking, I get some sphagnum moss. Now, I reuse my sphagnum moss, so I make sure I sterilize the moss between uses to lower the chances of mold growth. I then strain them out and leave to cool before spreading them out into a sealable plastic container. Now, you can put the seeds straight into the sphagnum moss and mix them through. However, I find that it makes it quite hard to keep an eye on your seeds. So instead, I fold a paper towel to length cover the moss, and then dampen the towel. Now it's time to strain out your seeds and spread them out across the surface of the damp paper towel. Cover the seeds in another damp paper towel, put the lid on, and move to the refrigerator. The amount of time you leave the seeds in the refrigerator will vary depending on the species that you're growing. Now, make sure you check on them regularly and remove any seeds that start to show mold. Thanks for watching. If you like what you saw, subscribe for more tips and techniques. I'll see you later.